Hello there guys, Coaster Chal here, Donkster Born, but built for theme parks, and welcome to a theme park newsroom update, where today we're going to be checking out a brand new concept from Rocky Mountain Construction, the brand new Family Hybrid Coasters. Oh, it's very exciting. Uh, now, obviously, this is a brand new concept. We're going to share the official description of the ride on RMC's website, which I have personally linked in the description down below so go and check it out for yourselves uh, but for now guys please like comment subscribe click the notification bell so you never miss another youtube video and for now let's have a look at what's going on with the rmc family hybrid coasters rmc began its journey into the amusement industry through traditional wooden roller coaster installations in an effort to improve the ride experience rmc developed the pot potato patented <laughs> it's a hard word to say patented ibox track system uh, these rides have been thrilling goers across the world for over a decade however these rides may be too thrilling for some guests family coaster passengers will enjoy the smooth ride of the ibox track system while experiencing family friendly elements rmc offers three standard layouts with different elements and footprints to best fit the available real estate there's also the ability to cost develop a custom layout the family hybrid coaster utilizes the same state of the ibox track technology as rmc's award-winning hybrid coasters but with a more modest ride layout this allows patrons to enjoy a smooth ride as a family with a thrill level more suitable for those who may be too short or just not ready to ride an extreme rmc hybrid roller coaster the family coasts are all designed and manufactured by RMC at our facility in Hayden. So it's very, very interesting there from RMC and a very good looking family hybrid coaster. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen, thrill six of all ages. That is looking at the RMC family hybrid roller coasters. Uh, now, obviously, you want to know my thoughts on this. That's what I think of it. Um, I, I, I'm, I'm a huge fan of this concept. Really big fan of this concept. I think the whole design of it is amazing. I think the whole styling of it is incredible. I think that the overall feel of it is amazing. I think that the... Uh, the artistic design on the concept arts from what you could see from uh, a few of the layout concepts and the custom layout concepts, etc. I think they've got a real shot with this. Now, of course, the big debate is where will this go in the future? And I think there's a few chain companies that will want to invest in this. I mean, you've got to think. Uh, Six Flags will want to get their hands on this. Cedar Fair will want to get their hands on this for the families. Maybe for something like a Michigan's Adventure or something or a Valley Fair. Um, Six Flags will want to try and invest this into La Ronde or Darien Lake or whatever. Probably not La Ronde, but uh, Darien Lake, Great Escape, all those different places. There's a small uh, a, a amount of small uh, USA parks that will want to invest in this as well. Small independent parks uh, as well. Uh, maybe Glenwood Caverns could benefit from this. Um, I mean, could you imagine... I don't know. I mean, Silver Dollar City could do like a mini outlaw run, couldn't they? <laughs> uh, but in all seriousness, no. I think Europe could benefit from this. I think Europe could definitely benefit from this. I think um, some family parks in, in Europe would definitely do well with this. I mean, you look at some of the family parks uh, out there in the European countries, uh, like Germany, France, Italy, etc. Um... I mean, there's, there's loads of them. I mean, if you know, if Fantasyland wants to do something RMC but nothing too big, then they could do something like that and theme it up nice and well and do like a nice custom layout or something. If they wanted to go up a level in terms of the thrill level maximum for that type of coaster, they could put maybe one inversion in there if they wanted to. I, I don't know. But um, it should be interesting. It should be really, really interesting to see what happens. But I'm a big fan of this concept. So... Thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And for now, my name is Coast Shell. Coop, living the coast life. And I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a rocky-tastic day. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs>